Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, mpenzi mtazamaji na mfuatiliaji wa vipindi vyetu uh, channel yetu Nur Mustafa sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Kwa mara nyingine tena leo tupo katika mwendelezo wa uh, masomo yetu ya ziada na leo tunagusa katika somo la history ama historia. Kwa wale ambao wanasoma skuli za private wana wanatumia neno history na wale wanaosoma skuli za government wanatumia somo historia. Kwa hiyo katika somo letu la historia uh, a student has to learn several topics in standard 6 due to the Zanzibar syllabus program. Uh, therefore here we do have uh, uh, at least seven topics. If you are a student in standard 6 you have to learn seven topics. And here I'm going to make introduction of all topics that we are going to learn in standard 6. Uh, the first topic is uh, the first topic is uh, uh, what can I say uh, colonialism uh, it is known as a colonialism but here we are going to touch about the colonialism in other country uh, beyond of Tanzania or Zanzibar therefore we have to know that colonialism in other countries of Africa Kenya Uganda and Nigeria this is will be our first topic introduction of topics Introduction of topics. As I told you that uh, here, first topic is known as a colonialism. Colo colonialism. In colonialism here, the first topic you are going to know that uh, colonialism in other countries of Africa, Kenya, Uganda, and Nigeria. I mean that beyond of Tanzania. So, as I'm writing here, the colonialism in other country. This is our first topic, colonialism in other in other countries of Africa of Africa uh, Kenya, Uganda such as Kenya Uganda and uh, Nigeria. Here we are going to see the colonial rule, colonial rule, utawala wa kikoloni. Tutakuja kuona jinsi gani watawala waliweza kuzitawala nchi hizi katika swala la mambo ya kikoloni. Na vile vile katika kipengele chake cha pili tutakuja kuona colonial economic, uchumi wa kikoloni. Jinsi gani wakoloni waliweka uchumi wao, waliweza kuanzisha uchumi wao katika nchi hizo tilizo ambazo nilizoziorodhesha hapo. Na vile vile tutakuja kuona we are going to see, we are going to see the social service in colonial rule. Uh, mfumo ulio uliokuwa kitolewa katika huduma za kijamii, mfumo aliokuwa kitumia wakoloni in providing the social service in in, the, in those countries. Therefore, uh, also our second topics will be the movement for struggle for Zanzibar independence. Movement for struggle for Zanzibar independence. Here, tukizungumzia hivo ni harakati za mapambano ya utafutaji wa uhuru wa Zanzibar. Harakati za mapambano za utafutaji wa uhuru wa Zanzibar. Uh, as I'm, I'm writing here, movement... of movement for struggle for Zanzibar independence here in the topic Yambayo we are going to learn at uh, the second in this we are going to see some of the of the subtopics within these topics. The first one is uh, the first movement of struggle for Zanzibar independence. The first movement for struggle for Zanzibar of harakati za mwanzo zilikuwa zikitendeka katika utafutaji wa uh, uhuru wa, wa, wa Zanzibar. Kama tunavyojua kwamba uh, Zanzibar pia ni nchi ambayo iliyopata uhuru. Na hii kwamba nchi hii ilipata uhuru kupitia mapinduzi. Na hapa tutakuja kuangalia 
mbele wakati tutakuja kuchambua vizuri topics hii uh, and also within the same topic we shall know association and uh, labor parts association and uh, labor parts uh, vyama vya kijamii na vyama vya wafanyakazi uh, hapa tutakuja kuona jinsi gani wakati huo wa kikoloni vyama vya kijamii na vyama vya wafanyakazi vilivyokuwa viki vikichukua nafasi yake na last one we are going to see the same topic uh, political parties uh, within the same uh, period and uh, after that we shall know the third topics which is known as a movement for zanzibar independence movement for zanzibar independence movement for zanzibar independence this will be uh, the, the third topic of our syllabus of standard six here is if you are a student of standard six you have to know these topics uh in this topic i mean that movement for zanzibar independence movement for zanzibar move independence movement for zanzibar movement for zanzibar independence uh, harakati za mapinduzi uh, za uhuru wa zanzibar tutakuja kuona kipindi hicho uh, how our the citizen of zanzibar could be colonized themselves from uh, colonial rule therefore within this also we are going to see zanzibar revolution zanzibar revolution i mean that with the, with the same topic of movement for zanzibar independence harakati za kutafuta uhuru wa zanzibar kwa hiyo hapa tutakuja kuona jambo kubwa ambalo lilikuwa limetumika na maarufu sana this is very famous in tanzania it is known as zanzibar revolution zanzibar revolution kwa hiyo we shall know how uh, our the, the citizen of, of Zanzibar could be colonized so as to to fight from the colonial colonialist uh, in Zanzibar revolution Zanzibar revolution and also uh, when we see that the fourth topic the first topic it says or the first topic says uh, the movement of for struggle for Tanganyika independence the movement for struggle for Tanganyika independence kama tunavyojua kwamba uh, nchi ya Tanzania imeundwa na nchi mbili kwa wakati huo ilikuwa ni moja ni Tanzania ni Zanzibar na moja ni Tanganyika sasa kila nchi hizo mbili uh, zilitumia upande wake katika utafutaji wa uhuru katika kujikomboa therefore uh, as I, 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 I have uh, introduced here in the third topic we shall know the movement for Zanzibar independence and also in the fourth topics we shall know I mean that the part of Tanganyika country at, the, at that time uh, it was Tanganyika and uh, we, 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 we shall know how the movement of struggle for Tanganyika independence uh, we are going to know several uh, aspects the first aspect within that topic uh, we are going to see Tanganyika independence and the political parties attainment of Tanganyika independence as I am I'm writing here uh, therefore the first topic the first topic I've said the movement of Tanganyika independence. Tanganyika independence are uh, within here we are going to see uh, some of the aspect are the following the first one is Tanganyika independence itself Tanganyika independence
Uh, the second, we shall know political parties, political parties in Tanganyika. Uh, political parties in Tanganyika and also we are going to know attainment of Tanganyika independence attainment of Tanganyika independence Attainment of Tanganyika independence. Tanganyika independence, uh, uhuru wa Tanganyika political parties, uh, vyama vya kisiasa wakati huo, and attainment of Tanganyika independence. Upatikanaji wa uhuru wa Tanganyika. Uh, iyo ilikuwa ni pati ya nene ambao ni topiki ambao tutakujia kuyona katika mwendelezo wa vipindi vingine. Na bile vile tunakujia kuona topiki ya tano. I mean the, 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 the fifth topics. The fifth topics, we are going to see the biggest issue which is very important and it, which, which, which can celebrate each year. Uh, this is, will be the Union of Tanganyika and Zanzibar. The Union of Tanganyika and Zanzibar. The Union of the Union of Tanganyika and Zanzibar. Uh, the Union of Tanganyika and Zanzibar, uh, this is, a, what, as, as I've told you that before, uh, this is a very a crucial issue which can be memorized by each uh, citizen of Tanzania. So the Union of Tanganyika and Zanzibar uh, resulted in something which is known as a Tanzania. So the country of Tanzania is produced or was produced within these terms, Tanganyika and Zanzibar. And within this, we are going to see the theory of union. Theory of union. Theory of union. Nadharia ya mungano. Nadharia ya mungano. So we are going to know what is union and uh, some of the things which could be seen. Uh, within that time of finding or of struggle for union and also the reasons of union the reasons of union the reasons of union we shall come and see some of the reasons or many reasons of union wadi tanganyika or zanzibar in tanganyika were united so, because these are some of the reasons, or many reasons, which resulted in them doing such thing. And also, within the same topic, you are going to see achievement or challenges of union. Achievement and challenges of union. Achievement. Achievements and challenges. Uh, faida ama matunda na changamoto za mungano. Um, in spite that we, we were united, but uh, there are some of achievement or main achievement that we see till now. And also, apart from the achievement, and also there are some of the challenges that are uh, appeared, that are appearing uh, now, uh, within this, within this time. Uh, after seeing that the Fifth topics, now we are going to see the sixth topics, sixth topic, which says, the thick six topics, the sixth topic we are going to see, or we are going to learn, it is known as a, the liberation of other countries of Africa. The liberation of other countries of Africa, such as Ghana, Zimbabwe, and Mozambique. The liberation, this will be the sixth topic, the liberation. Of other
of Africa. Uh, those countries such as Ghana, Ghana, Zimbabwe, and Mozambique. Ah, kwa hiyo tutakuja kuangalia topic yetu ya sita ambayo itakuwa ni the liberation of other countries of Africa uh, such as Ghana, Zimbabwe and Mozambique. Kwa hiyo ukombozi wa nchi zingine za Kiafrika kama vile Ghana, uh, Zimbabwe na Msumbiji ambayo kwa jina jingine linaloitwa ni Mozambique. Uh, katika kipengele hichi tutakuja kuona the movement of fighting for Ghana independence. The movement of fighting for Ghana independence. Uh, we, we shall come and see some of the uh, harakati that could be uh, used so as to decolonize Ghana or finding Ghana independence. And also the, the second uh, in that uh, topic, I mean the, the, the subtopic within, the, within that topic is known as uh, the movement of fighting for Zimbabwe independence. The movement of fighting for Zimbabwe independence. Harakati za kupambana ama kutafuta kwa uhuru wa Zimbabwe. Na vile vile tutakuja kuona kipengele chengine yamba chuchamwisho katika niniyo. Uh, the movement of struggling for Mozambique independence. Harakati za kutafuta uhuru wa msumbiji. Now, vile vile, we, we, we are going to see uh, other topics, which is known as, uh, I mean, that this will be our last topic within history in Standard 6. Uh, this topic will be social, political, and the economic change in independent Africa. After Africa could be decolonized from the colonialist power, they could establish several system of their power how they they, they, they could be uh, colonized uh, they could be what can i say they could be holding the power themselves therefore within this topic we shall see the system of social political and economic changes in, in independent africa how africa could be decolonized how Africa could be holding their power. Uh, therefore, this will be last to our last topic, which is known as the social, social, political, and uh, and the economic changes and economic changes uh, in independent Africa Katika kipengele hichi ambao ni topic yetu wa mwisho kwa standard 6 tutakuja kuona social political and economic changes in independent Africa. Uh, mabadiliko ya kiuchumi, ya kijamii na ya kisiasa wakati wa Afrika ilipoanza kuwa huru. Kwa hiyo kwa sababu baada ya Afrika kuwa huru kila nchi ilijitegemea mwenyewe katika mfumo wa madaraka. Na ilianzisha system zake za utawala. Kwa hiyo na utawala huo ulibezi zaidi ama katika social, political and economic changes. Uh, kwa hiyo katika kipengele hichi vile vile tutakuja kuona kama tutakuja kuona, kuona mambo mengi kama vile topic ambayo sub topic ambayo inasema changes in provision of social services, changes in provision of social services, uh, mabadiliko ya utoaji wa huduma za kijamii. Uh, kama tulivyosema kule mwanzo tutakuja kuona katika kolo, 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 colonialism jinsi gani wa koloni waliweza kutoa huduma za kijamii wakati wa utawala wao uh, kwa kutawala Afrika lakini vile vile sasa huku tutakuja kuona jinsi gani uh, wa, wa Afrika wenye wao baada ya kuwa tayari wameshajikomboa kutoka mikono ya kikoloni how, how could be provide how could be provide providing uh, some of our important things or important services such as uh, social services uh, kwa hiyo hapa tutakuja kuona change in provision of social services change in 
provision. Change in provision of social service. Mabadilishu, ama mabadiliko ya utowaji wa huduma za kijamii. Uh, na vile vile tutakuja kuona political changes in, in free Africa. Political in independent Africa or free Africa. Mabadiliko ya kisiasa katika uh, Afrika ilio huru. Jisigiani walianzisha mifumo yao ya kisiasa kutokana na katiba ambazo walizo ziunda. Na vile vile tutakuja kuona economic changes in free Africa. Economic changes in free Africa. Economic change in free Africa. Tukuja kuona economic changes Change which is based in economic matters in free Africa. So, katika kutoa majumuisho ya topics ya mbazo tutakudia kuzi hona, uh, let me stop here and uh, we shall come and meet or continue with the second or other topics in analyzation of each topic. Uh, Kwa hiyo, kwa leo, tutaishia hapa, tutakuja kuonana katika mjumuisho wa vipindi vingine vitakavu endelea. Endelea kufuatilia channel yetu bora ya Nuru Mustafa sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Katika mfumo wetu wa kufuatilia masomo yetu ya ziada. Wa hatha salamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu.